Well, as what's the crack? My name is Orgy Runner, and I am wearing the completely wrong glasses for this. <laughs> Whoopsies. And welcome to Telltale's The Walking Dead, the definitive series. Right, confession time, I've never played this game or these games because I was a bit of a cynic when they first came out. I didn't like the idea of episodic games. I always thought they were a bit of a ripoff, but... Seen as I've been binge watching, binge, binge watching, binge watching the Walking Dead series again from start to finish, I started to get a bit of an itch just to play the game. So I went on to the PlayStation Store and missed the sale. So then I went on Amazon and bought a physical copy. So either way, I'm sorted. I'm, I'm sorted. So let's get right into it. Now I do know a teeny tiny bit about the games. I know not that much. I only know. The main characters' names, I think that's Clementine and the guy there, that's Lee. Not sure what sort of relationship they have, whether that's her dad, her uncle, her brother, I, I, I don't know, best friend. Either way, I'll find out once I get in. And here's the main menu. Now, I hope this is in 60 FPS, although I'm not 100% sure. I've been a bit disappointed with a few remasters for the PS4. Especially... The Mafia games, Mafia 2 Definitive Edition or the Definitive Collection, whatever, that was supposed to be in 60 FPS, or I thought it would be in 60 FPS, but it never was. It was locked to plain old 30. Very disappointing. Either way, enough chit chat. Let's get right into the guts of this game. Pun very much intended. And if anyone else is wondering, these are uh, very reflective. I think they've got like anti glare on them, so. Yes. When I look into the light, you can't see my eyes because all you see is the ring light. Can I do it? Yeah, look, there it is. Okay, I do believe this is Atlanta, the same place where the main series or the main series was based in, at least for season one. I say the main series, but I mean the TV series. Okay, and this is Lee, I do believe. What you doing town for, boy? You caught doing the drugs? Well, I reckon you didn't do it then. Oh, that's nice. Thanks for believing me. Uh, you know what they say about reckoning. You know what they say about reckoning. I don't, but I reckon it's a lot like a sumo. Yeah, something like that. You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the, I didn't do it. But I didn't do it. But definitely not, either way, uh, often time, not for me. Not for me. Because guys in your position already said it enough. Okay, so right stick, look around, can I move, can I shuffle? Okay, look at the rear mirror, okay. I can get the hang of it. Making, is that short for Jamaican? Oh, wait, Macon, you're from Macon. Yep, came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. I always wanted to work a murder case, like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in. With all due respect, a real shame that is. Hell, the whole family used to be regulars at your folks' drugstore right in downtown. Still there? Sure is. Good. Okay, so I constantly have to look at the rearview mirror to engage with this guy. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on my sixth year. You meet your wife in Athens? Ooh, tough you subject. You know how I see it? Uh, not really. Not really. Well, too bad. My car. <laughs> you might have the right to remain silent, but it don't mean I gotta be. Ah, touche. Wait, cat got your tongue? Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. 
Hey now. Yo, fuck you. <laughs> what? I thought I said something. Any of that seem important to you? All of them. That box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention and you'll drive yourself crazy. I'm driving this man once. He, he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella, big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you sit. Then before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. And I tell him he's got to stop. That's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. <laughs> That's a good goofy impression, by the way. But maybe he maybe was, he was innocent. 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 Innocent? They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show, people will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. Oh, I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit less depressing than a bit. Hey, hey, road, road, zombie. So. This other time. Oh, Jesus. Hope he was wearing his seatbelt. And speaking of crying bloody murder, I guess someone's being murdered right now. Probably officer friendly right there. Ooh, that does not sound one bit good. Wakey wakey, eggs and bakey. That looks bad. Hopefully that's not a bite. If it's a bite, you're done for. Ooh, shotgun, I should take that. Why the hell did he have his gun out? Probably to shoot zombies. Maybe, Maybe. he was tossed from the car during the wreck. Oh. That is a good possibility as hey. well. Hey, officer. Are you all right? I'm still cuffed back here. Yeah, now I think he's taking a bit of a nap. Officer? Oh my, that doesn't look good. He wasn't ejected from the car. He's not moving. What about me? Can I move? Can I look anywhere else? Oh, oh okay, I can. I can just bust open the window like so. Okay, one more time. Third time's charm. Oh, come on. Last time, with feeling. Not too bad, not too shabby. I wonder I can actually scooch over now. I thought it was just going to be a completely point and click game, but no, I've got some semblance of movement, which is good. I think that's this thing or the point and click aspect of it. Oh god. I think that's what turned me off the games at first because I didn't know too much about them, I didn't want to know. Just when I saw this clicker here, I just thought, oh god, it's just gonna be all point and click. But no, so far, I think it's okay. I think it shows potential, at least for myself. Can I move anywhere else, or am I just stuck to this one place? Uh, I guess I am for now. Officer? You still alive, buddy? You wanna tell me more stories? God damn. Oh, yes, the keys of freedom. Gotta grab those. Yeah, 
cuff. Ah, oh, yeah, freaking butter fingers. Easy. Huh. He He's not gonna bite you. Yet. Aha, freedom. Officer. You awake? Oh god. Yeah, he's definitely awake and kicking. Oh god, I got it. Oh god, oh god, god, get away. What in the hell? Shotgun shell. Meat shotgun. Oh, go, go, grab it, grab it. Oh my god, you freaking Vaseline fingers. Pick it up. Get away! I don't want to do it, but I will. That was oddly satisfying. Oh, that's Clementine. Hey, Clem, you want to help me? Help! Go get someone! There's been a shooting. I know the one who did it. But I swear to God it was in self-defense. Mostly self-defense. Uh-oh. That doesn't sound good. Oh, no, that's not good at all. Jesus Christ, man, watch where you're walking. Run, 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 or shuffle, stumble, whatever. Just don't get eaten. Oh God, get up, get up, get up. Oh no, offense, my mortal enemy. Can I fall? Oh yeah, there he goes. And surely they won't be able to break it down. But they can sure sell try, I suppose. Alright, where's everybody going? Bingo? <laughs> I, I just had to say that. I had to be corny. Hello? Anybody? Nobody? Anyone up here? No ladder. <laughs> I'm not getting up there anyway. This leg the way it is. I suppose you could try, but, uh, you know, video game logic. I'm filling one of those teacups with some bourbon if I could. Okay, so the guy likes a bit of a drink. God knows he needs one. Okay, so I can do a bit of exploring here, can I? Can I go out the gate? Maybe I should just check inside the house through the glass door before wandering out into the neighborhood. Maybe, maybe. Although some people might consider it breaking and entering. But who am I to judge? I wonder if anybody's home. Hello? Anybody home? Hello, friendly stranger here. Help. Just murdered a cop. Hello? There's something going on. Wait, 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 hold on. Ah. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? Can't make any promises. Ah. Hello? I'm not an intruder. I'm one of them. Ooh. These people might be wild and I don't. This looks 
looks very gloomy. Yeah, can I check out the whole house? Or am I just stuck to one area? Furniture overturned, blood everywhere. Jesus. And what else is interesting here? Oh, kids painting. God, that kid lived here. Oh yeah, just Clementines. This whole neighborhood is deserted. What the hell? What's that beeping? I believe that would be the phone. Uh, cables out. Okay, what else? What else? What else? Because I don't want to miss a thing here. Well, that's the phone. But there's there also... Are three new messages. There's also a kitchen here. I want to explore this. Oh, jeez. Uh, not more to explore, is there? I don't think so. Anything on the table? Oh, water fruit. Oh, yes. Give me one of my five a day. It's fake day. Oh, no, it's fake. Well, beggars can be choose. Oh! Dude, you knew that was there. Yet you chose to slip in it. Yeah, moon. Oh my god, the sacred butter, yes. Actually, no, that's the last thing you need. Freaking butterfingers. Okay, anything in here? Well, walk them, talk them. Yes, give me one of those. This drawer. Nada. Come on, there's gotta be something good. Oh no, just more butter. I think you've got plenty of that already. This there place has been ransacked. Just about anything worthwhile is gone. Nope. I think all of this is fruitless, to be honest. Yeah, pretty fruitless. What about the cupboard? Surely there's got to be some noms in here. Okay, well, at least they're prepared for the coronavirus. For the amount of tissue paper they have stacked away. Absolutely not a, except this glass. You seriously pick up that glass without at least washing it. It's not there are three new messages. I mean, you could have... I mean, God knows how long that water has been there. I mean, water doesn't really go off, or does it? But still, you just pick up a, a random glass in a stranger's house, you don't know what you could have. You could have cooties for all you know. I always get tested for cooties. Three new messages. It's some serious shit. Message one. Left at 5.43 p.m. Hey, Sandra. This is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before the spring break. I'm guessing you want back in time. PM. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message three. 
The mom and dad. G guess they never made it out of Savannah then. Daddy? Huh? Hello? I'm not your daddy. You need to be quiet. Says who? Yes, uh, I'll just say I'm not a monster. I'm not a monster. Good. Where are you hiding? Uh, I'll just ask how old are you? How old are you? Eight. And you're all alone? Yes. I don't know where anybody is. How old are you? I'm, uh... Thirty-five. Seven. Okay. Oh, close enough. And where are your parents? Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? And what about you? You safe? Are you safe? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. Hello. <laughs> Wait, what? <gasps> Oh god, I don't know what to do, I don't know what to do. Ooh, get concussed. And that was karma. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Hey, get off, grab your hands. Jeez, you weren't wrong making tracks, Glenn. Now give me that hammer. Come on, Clem. Kill it. Oh. Don't give me that. Give me that thing. It's hammer time. Okay, stop. Hammer time. You dead? Okay, we're well, definitely dead now. And what? Lovely white eyes you have, or had. Man, hi there. Hey, I just murdered Did your you babysitter. I think. Uh, yeah. Yes. It's okay. I think she was a monster. I think so too. You've been all by yourself through this. Yeah. I want my parents to come home now. I think that might be a little while, you know? Mm -hmm. Oh. Look, I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until then. What should we do now? Uh, look for help before it gets dark or get out of here once the sun goes down. Uh, I'd say get out of here once the sun goes down, yeah. We need to get out of this neighborhood. It's not safe. We're less likely to be seen if we move at night. My parents might come home. We won't go far. We'll try to find shelter and come back here with others. That sounds good. We can hide in my treehouse until then. It'll be a tough climb with this leg, but that's a good idea. Or, smart idea. Stay close to me. Stay in the house. Ooh, it's quiet. Now let's stay quiet. We'll head out to the front yard and follow the road out of the neighborhood. Okay. It'll be okay. Stay near me. And we'll move as fast as we can. Okay, another thing about this game, sir, there's multiple choices. 
So each decision you make, well not each decision, but each key decision you make affects the outcome of the chapter. I think so you get multiple different endings for each for each chapter, but I think ultimately once you reach the end of the season or once once we reach the end of the season, it won't really matter because it'll have a set ending. But it would be nice to explore different scenarios if I could go back and play it once I have completed it. Speaking of which, how long have I been recording? I don't think I've been recording too long. Half an hour. Most of my videos are an hour. But I think... I think, you know, these games aren't that long. I'm not sure how long a chapter is. Because I think in each season there's about four chapters, five chapters. I I don't know. I I have to look into this. I definitely wouldn't get a whole chapter complete in one video. Hmm. And I think this does seem like the perfect place to e end this one anyway. Yeah, yeah. I'll just end it here. It'll just be a bit of a trial run video, just to see what suits my style of content. To see what type of kind of people watch it. People like. My long form content do people like my short form content do people like my content at all who knows it will forever be a mystery to me and everybody else so yeah i think it's a good place to leave it off yeah no didn't get a lot done didn't progress very far but we met the main two characters here little little clemmy wemmy and lee wee 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 lee 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 wee wee lee 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 okay Right, enough chit chat. Guys, you know what to do if you did enjoy this video by some freaking miracle god bless you if you did. Be sure to give it a massive thumbs up, comment, favorite, share, and of course, like always, I'll see you in the next one. So, until next time, see ya.